Hello, my fellow guardians. This is Maluncha, and welcome back to Destiny 2. It's Season of the Lost, week four, and that means new challenges and new quests to continue. Well, old quests to continue, however you want to call it. We've got quests to continue. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, like always, get a look into what we are going to need to do today. Seasonal challenges, and apparently we already have completed a couple. So, we got the Wayfinder's Forge, which we are going to do today, of course, uh, and score and defeat it for this week. We got Astral Telemetry Parallax Trajectory Collected, 6,000, so pretty good there. Uh, Astral Authority, defeat combatants with Trace Rifles in the Shattered Realm or Astral Alignment. We got Leyline Mysteries, we got uh, two Trivial Mysteries, we got Ascended Mysteries, so that's uh, new. We got Ascended Mysteries, we got Trivial Mysteries, and we got, where was it? Enigmatic Mysteries, so yeah, there's a lot of mysteries that I'm gonna need to look at. And Ascended Mysteries, they kind of sound... Uh this kind of sounds good. Uh, entertain lore checks to complete matches in showdown. Crucible playlist earn bonus progress for wins. We've got high value hunter defeat powerful combatants in gambit earn bonus progress for defeating high value targets. We got trials of the tinker uh, that says we need to unlock artifact mods and we unlocked all twelve of them, so we completed that one already. We got precision calibration, calibrate marksman weapons, scout rifles, sniper rifles, and linear fusion rifles. By landing precision final bows, blows, bonus progress against guardians. Okay, and then we got the vanguard chosen this week. Complete any nightfall strike on a hero, difficulty or higher. Uh, you need to do that three times. You actually get a nightfall weapon. So that's pretty cool quest where you can actually get some nightfall weapons. And there's only nine quests this week. So yeah, pretty, pretty good. Let's continue. And we're rank four. 50. I know there's probably a couple people already at rank 200 or something like that. Okay. Blue marker this week. Each ascendant beacon you reawaken reclaims a road once lost to me. Broadens my sight. But my realm still aches. Savathun has done so much to destroy everything my people worked for. She stole my brother from me. Twisted his mind and delivered him to his executioners. Then she had the audacity to steal him from the Traveler, manipulate him and lead him back home. It is strange having him here. And yet not. Fro is a wounded bird, flinching away from me, so much like Aldrin, but lost without a guiding hand. Do you understand why I forbade him from speaking with Savathun? This reunion is such. Cruel kindness. I will find a way to repay her for it. And you will continue to bring me the Techians I need to do so. So let's accept and see what we need to do. Wayfinders Forge. Form an astral alignment with the blind well using your Wayfinders compass. Zivu Wrath must be terrified of what Savathun might say. She's not the only one. I sense the same fear from you. As strange as it sounds, we may have stumbled into a beneficial situation here. How so? Your Techians are scattered and the Dreaming City is on the verge of being overrun. Yes, but at least we're fighting on our terms. With Savathun as bait, Zivu Arath has come to us, on our field of choice. Watch the Harvesters to time the Aether release. Let's send these Scorn back empty-handed. The scorn are broken, 
then all that ether is lost. Better to lose the ether than the blind well. Good work, Guardian. Queen Mara, if your ritual goes according to plan, what will happen to Savathun? Without her worm, she'll be powerless. That seems like a waste. Imagine how much intel she could provide. To us? Or to you? Taken essences are the key to this fight. Bank them to repel the assault. We shut down the Taken Rifts and the Ley Lines are stabilizing. But until we reassemble Queen Mara's Coven, we're just plugging leaks. We've got Scorn inbound, Guardian. Better keep your compass safe. never seen Hive utilizing stasis. Don't you find that strange? I've never seen a warlock pull out a golden gun either. You may be a smartass, but you might also have made an unintentionally good point. Perhaps something about the Hive prevents them from wielding stasis. I don't think anything is that simple. But I feel like when we try to understand the darkness, we come up short. We're children trying to understand why the moon glows in the dark. We don't know what we don't know. Really? It's the reflection of the sun? Of course we know. Pure physics. Physics, right? <laughs> Alright, it was a pretty, pretty smooth blind well. Um, 13, 13 minutes-ish. So yeah, up next on the list as every week, we need to collect some parallax trajectory and that means we're gonna need to do strikes, gambit, crucible, whatever we can in this world to play that actually grants parallax trajectory and it's a lot. So as every week, I'm gonna run, uh, well, my, my strike. Last week it only took me one run. Uh, the week before it took me two runs to actually collect uh, all the parallax trajectory. So I'm going to go back to the tower, pick up every daily quest that I can, and then uh, go on a run till I have enough, and I'll see you guys after that. Okay, so we made it to the next step. I decided to do all three of my strikes, so I'm basically done, and I already got the pinnacle. And uh, yeah, we'll complete a bunch of quests, of course, uh, or daily, daily, yeah, daily bounties. Uh. So for the next step, we need to enter the Shattered Realm and we need to go to the Forest of Echoes. I do believe that is the first location that we ever went to, so... Journey forth, Guardian, and be bold. Bold we will be. So yeah, it's, uh, there's only three locations here, uh, as far as I can see, so yeah, we already seen how this one looks and uh, where you need to go i'm gonna quickly check i do believe yeah that's in the same location i think the first time we were able to see two ley lines not real sure but it's in the church again so i'm gonna spend the rest of this well this uh episode not but yeah this uh fight here not showing you because uh, we already been through it Go in. And let's align the last beacon. And get our Tekian free. Last beacon aligned. Be ready for anything. Thank you. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna mess with you like I did last time. Last time it took me ages to kill her. Very interesting that this time. Can't die though. Ah, I died. Of course I died. But so do you. There we go. Well done. We've detected the lost Techian's location through the beacon network. Bring her home. Hey, miss. Our successes here are mounting, Ikora. We may not need as many hands as you've sent. Are you asking me to recall the crow back to the city? You know this isn't a secure channel, right? All right, we need to go back to the helm, guys. Uh, and do what? Unlock the barrier enhanced breach ability. Okay. Enhanced breach. So let's take this one first so we can actually complete the quest. Now let's... Take these as well. And talk. How long have your hidden been privy to Aldrin's resurrection? Long enough to watch over him in your absence. And you didn't direct him home. Why? There was a concern he'd pick up some old habits. You know the god made him sick. Riven twisted his mind. Eris would have seen it. She is not so easily deceived by skin deep tricks. It's true I made mistakes, out of an idea of justice, out of grief. Are you leveling the same scrutiny toward Petra? Wasn't she supposed to be watching his grave? Petra has paid her dues. The Vanguard murdered him and has yet to pay theirs. We both lost family. I'm sorry for my part in yours, but Crow has been treated. My brother is dead. He was exhumed. His body twisted into caricature you had your vengeance is that what you're after Cade I still feel that grief like a stone caught in my chest some days it's more pronounced than others vengeance didn't erode that grief then tell me who am I to blame who sent him into Savathun's clutches who bludgeoned Aldrin into a scared animal and drove him from his home you did and those guardians who hurt him did so out of misguided anger. Don't make their same mistake. Don't make my mistake. Ooh. They're playing a blame game. <laughs> They're playing the blame game. One of the most fun games to play. Hey, Mara. Now, uh, let's... Uh, yeah, let's see? Like I said, it's like... Uh, every... Now we're gonna get one here, and then one here, and then one here. So we got one, two, three, four more to go before the circle is complete. Yeah, I wonder what happens when that actually does. Uh, will she be released from her tomb? Only time will tell. Let's interact. I've been thinking about family quite a bit. What with all the spare time I have. It might surprise you to hear but everything my siblings and I have done has been for each other. Even though the Vanguard isn't quite the same, they're no different at heart. You'd do anything for your family, chosen or otherwise. Go to any lengths to avenge them. Look at the Crow and Queen Mara. Siblings, bonded by cosmic fate, Forever orbiting one another like binary stars. Mara reminds me of my sister. She's afraid. Holding on so tightly because she can't bear to lose one more thing. But we all have to let go. When I am separated from my worm, I'll be separated from Zivu Arath too. And then my sister will be alone. The last of us. But as much as I care for her, I cannot stay like this. 
Everybody has their own story. So let's quickly do a checkup because I think this sounds in the last of the quests. Yeah, the ley lines are degrading, polluted, blah, blah, blah. Quest step will progress at the next weekly reset. And that also means week four, Wayfinders Voyage 4 completed. There we go. So yeah, let's like always clean the floor and sit our ass down in this nice little scenery with Savatoon imprisoned in the back. So yeah, um, this is where I'm gonna end up this episode, guys. If you wanna see more of my quest progression or my let's play here in Destiny 2 in Season of the Lost, just hit that subscribe button. It would always help out a lot. I do hope you enjoyed this episode and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.